I tell you, someone who's uh, pretty pleased with his results today is David Aputu Darwood from Western Super Mare. He's had some challenging times. He came from Gambia with his brother at the age of seven and was taken into foster care. For years, he struggled. But the boy who once hated going to school has managed to turn it all around. And today, his foster family and teachers could not be more proud. Heart in mouth time for David. All the studying, all the waiting. Now here in one small envelope, the results. English is good. Math is good. They take some digesting, but he is pleased. I'm happy with the results I got, like most of them, apart from English, obviously, because I have to retake that to be able to do what I want. But I'm proud of what I've got. I'm, I feel like I've done. I feel like I've done well. David didn't have the best start in life, but the support of his foster family helped him realise if he knuckled down at school, he could dream big. I don't think I would have been able to like change the way I did without have like having found this family. Because if I was at with any other family, I feel like I'd still be the same old David, just like um, not listening to anyone. Because I didn't used to talk much. They got me talking and like sharing how I'm feeling. There's so much he's had to work through and he, it's like one day he decided, right, I'm really going to turn things around and he, he just put everything into his work. David went from reluctant student to head boy and says his teachers have been amazing, giving all the help they could. Well, no, you know, you've got distinction. You've done really, really well as he stayed after school to study. He's an absolute symbol of what's possible when a young person takes full responsibility for what they want, where they want to be. That he's kind, he's hardworking, and he hasn't let any disadvantage hold him back. So he is, if you're looking for a decent citizen, someone that can influence others and make the world a better place, David is your man. It's never too late to change. As long as you try to change and, like, you do your hardest, there's there's nothing I could stop you as long as you just go for it, put your head down, anything's possible. Oh, look at that smile. Well deserved. Um, and now he's planning for college, sports science apparently. Wow. Future's bright. Future's really good. Well mm -hmm. done to him.